what is going on guys welcome back to the channel so i'm sure the first thing you probably noticed is you most likely looked at the title and went uh what uh you do know block we haven't even gotten the first map expansion bro and you were talking about a second one the reason why i'm doing that though is if they were to add a second expansion which i would say at this point yes we're obviously getting maui they could add a second one most likely in 2025 at least i'm saying that because it could be an idea that might be possible the big question I have for you guys though is if they were to add another map expansion on top of Maui or even let's just say Maui for example what are some of the big things you would look for in a map expansion this could be like more cities in there and even something like a big diverse of like terrains or even landscapes that way each vehicle class is most likely going to be more viable now the big question is though a lot of players are wondering if Motorfest will ever get a map expansion that is going to be completely away from Hawaii. To be honest guys, I just don't know if I actually see this happening. Quick example, let's just say we actually get Maui then a second map expansion that's part of Hawaii which at this point I would say does make a lot of sense. If they were to add something onto this map it's most likely going to be a second island and they are not going to add the fact that you can like fly to Alaska or you know go back to like the United States or who knows even like Europe or even a weird place like Japan or something like that that's completely off like where Hawaii is. That way, like, you can actually jump in a plane, go there. I just don't know if I see them adding something like that, man. That would be a massive expansion that would most likely take years to complete. And the biggest question everybody's also asking with Motorfest at the moment is, is this game even going to last long enough for something like that to be added? We all do know right now, once again, we're most likely getting at least one free map expansion. Is there going to be a second one? I would probably say there's a high chance we could probably get another map expansion in there. But then again, I just don't know if they're actually going to add even more of a massive update that's going to add another island, all kinds of more events, all kinds of more things on that said island with like, of course, the bridge going across it. But I would say having two more islands on top of the main one of Oahu would actually be pretty dang dope. Now, I did see multiple people saying they would love to actually see something added into the game to where you can fly out to like a different location. That's also part of the said Hawaii map of Motorfest. But again, guys, I just don't see something like that happening in this game. I mean, I really feel like we'd actually get a double expansion with like obviously having another island, which is going to have Oahu and then maybe like a bigger Hawaii island. That's bigger than Oahu and Maui combined or something. That would be also pretty dang insane. We all do know right now Maui's obviously going to be decently big with around 345 kilometers of total road network with some being on the actual asphalt and then of course some being on the dirt roads. This is obviously going to be a pretty decent size and most likely keep everyone away from Oahu for a bit. But one of my big concerns I did make in the other video talking about the new map expansion is do you guys actually think Maui could get boring a bit too quick? Because everybody is going to be playing on that map, whereas they're obviously tired of Oahu. So they're like, you know what, bro, let's all go to Maui for a bit. I wouldn't say it's going to get boring that quick because that's obviously a pretty big area to drive around on. And there's also going to be a lot more dirt roads, which I'm hoping for a lot more off-road type of rally events, rally raid events. And the reason why I do say that, though, is we can definitely agree right now there's not that many off-road events on Oahu where... You're obviously looking for more off-road events. There's going to be maybe three or four of them that you can actually do consistently and race off-road. Now, the good thing I have seen about Maui, though, is most likely going to come down to the fact that, yes, we'll have regular road events, but also there is most likely going to be a lot of new off-road events that is actually going to mix up the gameplay if you do like riding a rallycross bike or, you know, jumping on a motocross bike, even a rallycross vehicle. At least we are now going to have different vehicles to run on all kinds of different events. At least, you know, I'm hoping for that. But it does also make me wonder, though, if you guys are looking at a map expansion. Now, we obviously don't have a ton of information on Maui or haven't seen that much of it. But do you guys actually like to have big cities in that said map? Or would you actually rather have something to where the roads are going to be a lot more open, basically focusing on higher speed type of races with like a hypercar, like a street tiered vehicle? Where at this point, guys, I would probably say most players are going to go uh, blocked. You know what, dude? We need more cities. We need more of those type of roads in there. Even a lot of roads to where you can drift on, like winding roads would be pretty dang fun. And that was actually one of my favorite things about the crew too. 
Quick example on this, guys, you obviously had a bunch of different cities you could drive in. There was also going to be open highways, all kinds of winding roads in different locations. And I feel like that's going to help so much with like the diversity of actually racing in so many different areas. I do know a lot of players might enjoy like driving through like a city or something, whereas others might actually enjoy going through like a small mountain town, you know, going around like a winding road or something like that, big open highways. The best way to do it is to most likely have all of them. Now, who knows though, maybe Maui's actually going to be a small test to see how the fan base reacts to it. And then the next expansion, they're going to be like, okay, you know what guys, we need to add the city here. We need to have this area in this part of the map. We need this area here. Maybe it could be like an off-road track or something. Then we need this area here. And basically building off of what people wanted, like likes and dislikes of what Maui had and stuff like that. I think that's a possibility. And we can most likely see the next map expansion, if there is one, to be even better than what Maui actually is, even though it's not out yet. But kind of being optimistic here, seeing Motorfest is going to end up growing in year two. I do know, guys, some of the stuff might be complaining on this game and stuff. But at the end of the day, I have to admit this. I want this game to be good, man. I feel like adding a map expansion is a great step. We're obviously going to be getting new events and stuff like that. If a few other things can get changed on top of that, bro, we are definitely on the right track. Now, imagine having all of those things changed. Let's just do a quick example. Imagine for a second here, though, we end up getting all these new PvP events to where you can't pick your own class as a ranked mode. We also see a brand new summit overhaul that changes the entire summit around, making it even better, improving the rewards, basically improving the design of it which would end up dragging that many more players in. And also the new Summit is going to be played on the new map and stuff like that. So that is obviously going to be a huge win. One thing I would actually like to see guys, let me know your thoughts on this in the comments below. Would you like to see more class diversity of the overall class system in the game? What I mean by that is yes, we do have tier one, tier two, you know, in hyper cars. Would you guys rather see motorcycles in their own class and muscle cars, you know, supercars being in tier two, maybe, you know, classic cars being in tier one with like something like a Ford Focus being in like a, I don't know, like an everyday type of class or something. That way, like those cars can't compete. They're going to be separated and other cars can actually shine and be used a lot more often. That would most likely also shake up the entire meta in basically everything. But just imagine all that, guys, all that stuff being changed. Then we have Maui, of course, coming in November. And then we also have a second map expansion being added, adding even a bigger map than what we have in Oahu and Maui. You know, what's funny about this, though, is the more I keep talking about it, it really does sound a bit insane, doesn't it? I am legit talking about a second map expansion where we have not even gotten Maui yet, or at least we're getting closer to Maui coming out. And I am already talking about a second map being added onto it. But then again, though, I feel like the key word here is most likely going to be could they actually add a second map. Because we obviously haven't gotten Maui yet, so they probably want to see how that one's going to do. And then who knows, maybe as of right now, they're even working on a second map expansion that they most likely have planned for it. Let me know what you guys think about this in the comments below. Do you actually think Motorfest will get a second map expansion next year, or at least in the future, after all of this other stuff does end up coming out? I feel like it's going to be a pretty big possibility, but there's also going to be one key factor as well. Grand Theft Auto 6.